sent into the ancient past. Their dino watch will set off a mystic ice blast to save humanity, so they gotta move fast. This brave team will enter the dragon land. Fears no option, they got to get the fire rock. The superheroes are ready for battle Using the special powers together Dino Flows Driven to win one for all and all for one Dino Flows Nothing can stop them, not even Drake, come on Dino Flows Fighting together to save the whole planet Superheroes are ready for the fight United they stand together Dino might Nothing will ever stop them And the Dino Bros Race Against Time Stop screaming. <laughs> Tom, this would be a good time to transform. I can't. The watch is still recharging. The watch is what? It has to complete the cycle before I can transform again. <laughs> All right, I do not think the dinosaur is going to jump down after us. OK, I think you're right about that. Let's go, John. Now. Are you saying Kara and Jeno are together? I have no idea what I'm saying. What I'm asking you is a question. What do we say to Tom? Do you really think that we should say anything at all? You and John finally agree on something. He doesn't think we should say anything. He says we shouldn't meddle. I just don't understand how Kara could do this to Tom. It's not right. Maybe we should stick to this. I think I've safely determined Don't Worry Dad was written by someone who is female. Hey. Are you saying Kara wrote it? No, I'm saying the handwriting is an 80% match for the only female member of the Jurassic Eye mission. I hope they made it back all right. Yeah, I sure hope they didn't get lost, like we are. Come on, admit it. All those trees look exactly the same. Huh? Shh. I don't know if you heard something, but I did. Over there. Oh, come on! He's cornered us! Uh, the watch charged yet? At least tell us who you are. Nancy. If you think I'm just gonna slink away, you've got another think coming. Because I don't quit for anybody. Perhaps you don't understand, Professor. But there's no such thing as Project Jurassic Eye anymore. Stroker runs the show now. Show? We were established to do research. Well, you can tell him when he arrives. Everything is going well, Professor Stroker. And what time is the gate opening? Bert, I'm not leaving with Will still out there. The time gate is scheduled to open in four hours. The first shipment of diamonds is being prepared right now. As you can imagine, we're picking out the biggest ones, Acorn and above. We want to make a big impression back home. Everybody's excited. I'm even excited. Helen, get over here and take a look at this. Ah. Huh?
I guess it hasn't taken hold yet. Increase Will's dosage, Helen. Of course, Professor. Well, you don't appear to have passed through the digestive tract of a T-Rex. Gotta say, glad you made it back all right too, Melston. <laughs> Whoa, I was having palpitations. Melston told us about the Tyrannosaurus. Yeah, I gotta say, I was almost its lunch, but then Nancy came along and kinda saved my life. Nancy? And who's Nancy? Oh, just some lady, you know. Well, actually, there's a lot I could tell you about her. Now I know, and it's terrible what my eyes have seen. Humans armed with impossible machines like iron birds that can shoot dragons from the sky. Men targeting and capturing dragons for unknown purposes. Men out of their own time. Yet you yourself have crossed the gate of time into the world future. You have seen these future humans. What I saw there, Lord, was not like anything I've seen the other humans doing. I saw admiration, wonder for dragons, and fear. What are you going to do now? Lord Drakemon despises humans already, and when he finally understands what's really going on, he'll snap! Act carefully, General Vlad. As I have already said, the fate of the dragon prisoners is in your hands. Yes. Only you can save them. Only you. Yes. So she wears combat fatigues and has green eyes. Is that right? And with a ray gun that put a T-Rex right to sleep. Sounds like Miss Nancy is kind of thriving in the world past. Yeah, she's awesome. What you thinking? There was actually a female member of the Jurassic Eye mission, and maybe she's a survivor. Huh? What is that trying to tell you? Well, I don't know. I have no idea. I have never seen that before. Huh? The Jurassic truck is interacting with something external. You know, that looks just like a GPS signal. And it'll lead us to the glowing rectangle? That would be great. If you want to know, then you've got to go. Learn that in grad school. Tell me, how many mysteries can we solve at the same time? The navigator indicates northeast. Guys, I don't want to get too herbal on you, but I've got a feeling we're about to find something amazing. I asked around. Nobody knows anything about Vlad's secret mission. Shh, he's coming now. Hi, Vlad. So, how did it go with your big, important mission? Can either of you tell me where Drakemon is? Oh, I'm pretty sure you'll find him skulking around and talking to himself somewhere. But my friend, you look a bit worried. But you needn't be. We'll stop the Dino Froze. We will never stop fighting to protect dragons. Everything's about to turn around, I'm sure of it. I can't wait to find the magical glowing napkin. It doesn't have to be a napkin. Could be a blanket or some poster board, a hard-edged marshmallow. Great identification of white square stuff. Now what is that? Some dragons? Looks like there's two dragon fighters blocking our path. Are they trying to stop us on purpose? Why else would they be right there? Uh-huh. <laughs> you mess with the defros, here come the tusks. <laughs> Hang on, John. Slow down some. No, I want to mow them down, Tom. It's a trap. Ah! That was so close. Oh, those blades would have opened up the J truck like a can of tuna. You were so right. I'm very sorry that I didn't listen to any of you sooner than I did. It would seem that the dragons are actually getting smarter. I'd almost forgotten, but they're in the habit of using human prisoners to forge their metal. Well. I'd say it's about time we got some payback for those prisoners. Go with the pattern D. Laser stunning. Nice shot, Headzilla. 
Excellent work, as always. And so now, we keep going to the mysterious glowing rectangle. Man, our lives are weird. Look at them, just rushing about. None of them know that the end is already on its way. It's coming. I have important news, Lord. Not here, Vlad. Too many eyes and ears and not enough brains. Cursed humans! Hurry, fire up! Destroy them! Kill them all! Make them suffer! I knew how angry you would be, my lord, but men from the future world are capturing dragons! We taught these insects how to use fire, and this is how they repay us, is it? We must put a stop to this before Comet Fire Rock passes. The revenge of the dragons will be terrible and final, but we have much to do now. What's going on? The internal alarm has reported an escape. What the heck are you talking about? Are you telling me the kid's missing? Will ran away again, this time during his gene treatment. Well, come on. He can't have gotten far. Huh? Helen. I want this to go well. We have to be careful not to cause an alarm. I'm his father. I won't cause him alarm. Whoa, stop right there. I'll handle this myself. It's all right, son. You're doing great. It's okay. <sighs> We're finally here. Um, why did the J truck want us here? Uh, it thought maybe we'd like the view? Well, how about that? It's an actual rectangle, and it looks like a napkin. Looks to me. Like this has the same pattern as the time gate. The time gate? Professor, are you saying we discovered a time gate? Well, the Jurassic truck led huh? us to one. That means... Yes, Bob. We may have just found a way home. You have added the new blades, just as you ordered. He's been refitted with brand new materials. He'll be stronger. Dragon Blade, I need you to go at once to the Forest of Drums and protect the Fire Rock Fragment from the Dino Froze. I will be ruthless as always. Are you sure you got it right, Melston? I don't have small ears, and I heard the other man called Professor Stroker. So Stroker's alive? Yes, but evidently it seems his son Will is not well. Melston. Is there anything you can tell us about the woman? As you're also fond of saying, she's a mystery. What exactly do you mean by that? They say she pops up everywhere and then just disappears. Like a ghost? Yes, a live Dino one. Dino watch time. That's the dragon alarm. Code red. Let's go. Huh? huh? Looks like boss fight time. <laughs> Dino Rose, come out and play. The dragon has already reached the Forest of the Drums. Well, he's obviously been sent there to protect the Fire Rock Fragment from us. We don't have all day. We've got to get over to the Time Gate before it closes again. This is bad. The Time Gate countdown has already started. We'd better do this fast if we want to get home today. Ah! 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 The lightning. Dino Watch. But I bring the thunder. Ah. Yes. Tell us all about the dragon we'll be destroying this afternoon, Captain. Name, Dragonblade. Mutant Dragon Iron. Weight, 2.5 tons. 
Parts of his body have been hardened until they are as deadly sharp and strong as swords. Its special attack is to launch its wings, like sharpened boomerangs. Good. Tom, the dragon didn't spot you hopping off the J-truck. But I'm telling you, you better be quick. I've made my choice. Dino froze. Evolution! Ah! I also know that turning around and going the other direction isn't exactly going to confuse me, Dino froze. Ah. Sorry for knocking you out of the sky. Oh, no problem at all. Sorry in advance for slicing you into a bunch of gross little pieces. Ah! Ah! started a gardening service, you'd make a fortune! <sighs> that looks inconvenient. Mind if I give you a hand? <sighs> <sighs> Because this stuff isn't working, is it? Uh, uh. Uh, now I'll show you something that'll work. Exactly in a great position to be talking now, are you? You are me. Uh, uh. Uh, how much do you charge per law? Seriously, I've had enough of you. Uh. Uh, oh, oh. <laughs> Maybe I should stop pointing this guy up. I can't help it. <laughs> He's just so much fun. You should surrender, Dinofros, before I mow you down! Um, uh, is Tom in trouble? Dragonblade's a tough opponent. <laughs> if I pull that out of the rock, does that make me king? <laughs> I'm going to enjoy slicing you into little pieces and feeding you to the worms. No way is that the fire rock fragment. I think it's time for Johnny to get his hero on. Special attack, swarm of blades. It's all in the timing. Now! You can't jump forever. Maybe not literally, but I'm a raptor, so I can for a while. Huh? 
Double darn. Something tells me John might have gone outside the Jurassic truck. He found the fire rock. Yeah, but he also got spotted by Dragonblade. Oh, look, more yummy food for the worms. <laughs> John distracted Dragonblade. I'd better act right now. Special attack! Today, as a blender. Uh, 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 or better yet, an ice sculptor. Uh, or even more fun, I could just throw you off a cliff. Uh, 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 All right, big raptor. Isn't the time gate, like, closing? Hey, you're right. We should get moving. Dragon Blade failed, my lord. Yes, we must increase our efforts to find the other Fire Rock fragments and find out who these strange men are. Thank you, thank you. Hmm. Isn't it amazing? Diamonds as big as walnuts. Well, that's cutting it a little close. But they made it. <laughs> Boys, I don't know how to tell you this, but we can't all return home. What are you talking about, Professor? My father's right. Some of us has to stay. And keep fighting dragons. And don't forget finding and protecting fire rock fragments. I figured we could all draw straws. Or huh? matches, huh? in this case. Short ones stay, long ones go to Rocket huh? Town. Who's going huh? first? I will. Rocket Town, here I come. Short one. Short one. Short one. All right, then. John and I will both make our way to... Way ahead of you, Professor. I'm ready. John, you gotta bring back some food. I'll bring snacks as long as you promise to stay alive while I'm gone. We have to get going now, John. When you see my mother, will you please give her a massive hug for me, Dad? Yes, but only after I've made up a cover story about where you are. Sure. No! No? Huh? Nancy? Huh? There's something that you need to know. Before you go, you must set up the timing of your return. Um, how exactly do we do that? With this stopwatch. It's linked to the Jurassic Truck's chronometric computer. Hey, hang on a minute. Haven't I met you before? Oh my gosh. Wow, Nancy, Warnell's daughter. Whose daughter? Remember me, huh? I'm James Carter. Your father and I were very good friends for a long time. We were involved in quite a number of projects together. Huh? huh? I'd like to talk about some things, please.
The superheroes are ready for battle Using the special powers together Dinoflows Driven to win one for all and all for one Dinoflows Nothing can stop them, not even Drake, come on Dinoflows Fighting together to save the whole Superheroes are ready for the fight United 